Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. Happy New Year, Happy 2019 and I hope you guys will enjoy this year and I hope everybody gets success, everybody gets love, everybody gets what they actually want and um, I'm really happy to start my 2019 like this. So today in this video I am going to share my 2018 favorites and um, I am going to include a lot of makeup products in this. So let's not waste any more time and jump into the video. So the first thing I'm going to start with the skincare product. Firstly, I absolutely love this O3 Dermal Zone Sulfur Cooling Mask. This is amazing. It is superb because it just removes tan. It makes your uh, face, your skin calm and relaxing. I have reviewed this and I absolutely love it. So this is my most favorite skincare product of 2018. So the next thing I absolutely love in 2018 is a body moisturizer and that is by Neutrogena. This is for extra dry skin which is me. So uh, this is uh, the dermatologically tested one and this one retails for Rs 449. The next thing I absolutely love in 2018 is my perfume which is Lola by Marc Jacobs. I love it because Oh, it smells so delicious. It's floral, it's minty, it's a combination of a lot of like things. So I absolutely love it. So this was my favorite thing of 2018. Now coming to the makeup products. Firstly, uh, for primer, I absolutely love the Maybelline Must Prime Primer. It blows out the imperfection I have on my skin and it definitely gives a new, really nice moisturizing base so loved it i have two foundations that i really loved in 2018 first one is the raw raw what l'oreal paris pro matte foundation i'm in the shade 108 caramel beige and the second one i absolutely love is the maybelline super stay foundation loved it it's a go-to foundation for me now and these two foundation are great for oily skin yes I'm definitely going to do a battle video with this too because I have oily skin in summer and uh, I really want to try both of this in summer side by side and we'll come back to the review the next thing I loved is a powder by Maybelline and that is the loose powder this is the fit me loose finishing powder and I'm in the sheet number 20 light medium it definitely gives a little bit of color coverage and it definitely smoothen out so I absolutely love this one you should definitely go ahead and try this so the next thing I loved is the wet n wild contouring palette contour this is caramel toffee and the banana powder is great for dusky to medium skin tone as well as the contouring shade now coming to the highlighters I have used beautiful highlighters this year firstly the YVP cosmetics color cream in the shade goddess one of my favorite love 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 this thanks Shreya for this amazing product and you can definitely see it's uh, almost um, there is no product but I really want to buy another one so it's a must have. The next highlighter I absolutely love is the Nika highlighter. I took the shade Glitterati 02 which has a rose gold and a blunt gold shade. Like literally look at my cheekbone. It's popping. I love it. The formula is amazing. The color range is amazing. They have another one which is Moonlight I think. I don't remember but that is also great and I really want to try that again. The last highlighter I loved in this year was the Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter in the shade Molten Gold. They have come up with two other shades in India, I think. So you can definitely check that out. But I love, love, love this one. And I've also mixed the Nika highlighter and this on my cheeks. So it's literally popping. And this is so pretty. Like, look at this so freaking pretty love this highlighter 
Now for mascara, I don't think I want to tell you guys again and again, but I love this one. I'm not going to talk about this again. So the next thing I loved is, I absolutely love my Sigma Ace Liner, but then I love this one, the Sugar Eyeliner. It is so good. I think one should definitely have this in their vanity because it is very pigmented. The color is so good and the formula is again good and it's waterproof, so I absolutely love it. Coming to the glitter eyeliners, you have seen me using the Miss Clear Glitter Eyeliners. I have three shades with me. The one is Gold Glitter, you guys know that. The other one is Pink Glitter, which is another one. And the last one I have is a White Glitter. And this is a beautiful glitter. Let me swatch it for you. It's beautiful. Wait. I hope it's visible now. I hope this is visible now. This is such a beautiful highlighter. Um, not highlighter. This is such a beautiful glitter eyeliner that I really love. So these three products are really amazing. So my favorite. The next one is a glitter eyeshadow liquid one. And this is the Nika K Radiant Liquid Eyeshadow. And this is also amazing. Look. At the shade the shade is amazing formula amazing beautiful love it now coming to eyelashes I definitely love eyelashes from kingdom of lashes there's no denying I always end up using them only uh, the pack eyelashes are good but the pack eyelash glue is very good so I absolutely love it it's I think better than the kingdom of lashes lash glue I think this is good it's really affordable then I have two eye kajal pencils these are the pack long-lasting cold pencil this is coffee brown and this is in the shade skin which I'm wearing right now both of them are great amazing creamy texture stays for a longer time blends well if you want to smudge it so love this now coming to the eye makeup palettes I have five not much only five firstly I have the Jaclyn Hill X Morphe Vault Palette. Look at this palette. Love, love, love this one. It's amazing. The next one I have is the Jaclyn Hill X Morphe. This one, it's also amazing. Love the shades, love the pigmentation. The next thing I loved is the Glitter Galaxy. This one, X Shy Style Palette. Look at the glitters they have. You don't need to apply a glitter glue for this. Uh, the glitters are really pretty. I think one should must have this one. The next thing I loved is this one. This is the Morphe 39A Day to Create palette. And just look at the shades it has. Oh my god. Isn't it so pretty? I know. That's why I love it. <laughs> The last palette I loved is the Prism palette. Look at the shades. Amazing, beautiful. Oh, love the shade Pyramid. Love the shade Satin. Love the shade Lure. Obsidian is so pigmented. Yeah, these are the four shades I love. Throne is also beautiful. So, I think I will be doing a makeup tutorial. Not one. I think three or four looks using just this palette. Anyone interested? Let me know in the comment section below. Okay. Now lastly coming to the liquid lipsticks or the lipsticks. I have two to three options. I think I'm crazy about. So the first one is the Maybelline Matte Ink Lipsticks. These stays for a longer period of time. I know this I talked about in 2017. Um, but I think it's... Uh, such a great product that I should talk about every single time because it stays for a longer period of time. Next red shade I loved in 2018 was this one, Wet n Wild one. And this is in the shade Missy and Fierce. Love the shade. Love, love, love the red shade. The next two are from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. These are the Jeffree Star Liquid Lipsticks. Love the formula, love the shades. It's so comfortable. I think I'm gonna buy um, other ones really soon love it this is in the shade red rum and this is wifey and by nika 
this was really great i love the metallicious lip crayons the so matte lipsticks liquid lipsticks are really good but these are my favorites i am wearing actually the shade mona lisa and it's so pretty the price is really nice uh, it's affordable and it's comfortable and it's totally mad love it so yeah that's it that was my 2018 favorites and if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and share this video with your friends and family and yes i'm going to see you again on my next video till then take care i love you all bye guys